Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Ninja Gaiden. I am Rufal, playing this game for you. Woo! So it turns out Ryu's quest for vengeance has kind of been folly because apparently his father never actually died. That's a bit awkward. But, uh... Is it really true, though? There's no real reason to believe the guy. So, let's actually go find out for ourselves. Ah! Also, it should be noted, Act 6 is where, is where Ninja Gaiden stops caring about your feelings. If you are... Basically, if you are not a god at this game, then, uh, you might not be able to make it to the end. <laughs> so, uh... Yeah, save states could really come... will likely really come into use. But, uh, not until 6-3, really. Oh! It's certainly tempting to employ their help sooner. Yeesh. On up. Whoa! Well, that happened. Never mind, never mind. Just have to make do without the spin slash for now. Aha! Bother. The only reason save states will even come into play at all is because for the for the last boss, I'm going to want the spin slash just because this game's giving me enough problems already. I don't want to deal with that. <laughs> oh, for the love of! Go away. It's gonna be one of those days, is it? Alright, let's not mysteriously fall onto the ladder and die. Yeesh. We'll just die like that. Game, just let me play. I want to be done with you. Ah! Alright! Now for probably the most famous room in the game. Mostly because of the angry video game nerd. A lot of it has to deal with this guy. Alright. Before we jump, remember there's a bird. As long as we don't die to the bird, it's all good. Ah! Oh, get up there! Yeesh! Alright! Now we've arrived at 6-3! Real trick begins! Because, well, our spin slash is right here! 
I want to take it to take it to the boss at the end of this. Fortunately, I have plenty of Nimpo to work with, so this could happen as long as I don't accidentally pick up something along the way. But if I game over, that's when I'll bring in my save state. Pardon me, sir. Pardon me, bat. You die, and there's and there's the failure. Right. Figures. All right. Have you picked up again? Time to go up and do this properly. Hopefully. Say death past this point is just going to be reload. Fine, that'll do. Alright, every candle from here on out is another weapon we don't want. Oh. Ah, nuts to you. Huh? Who's all that then? Where are you? Show yourself! Even you cannot defeat the masked devil. Oh, well, it was the Jakio who, who said we deserve praise. None can beat me, even your father. Your father was not killed. He's been turned into the masked devil. Oh boy. No! Oh! <laughs> it will be entertaining to watch father and son fight to the death. Wake up, father! <laughs> it's no use. He thinks only of killing you. <laughs> Rats! Mouth wasn't lying. What do I do? Think! Think, boy! And think quickly! Think clearly and quickly. It's being controlled like a puppet. Gotta break the control. But what's doing it? Shiny object! That must be the culprit. Now just as a point of note, I'm going to demonstrate something. Because I have made my save state. But if you die to any of the game bosses, we get thrown back to 6-1. Not acceptable. And it's a three-phase boss fight. This is the only one where we get to have a sub-weapon. So... Yeah. 
Hold it! Where am I? Boy? <laughs> ah, she's awake! <laughs> That's a kill! You will both die! Take that! Oh! Father! Oh, he'll pay! <laughs> Alright, phase two! Which, um, sadly isn't even satisfying to do. Like most of the game, it's difficult until you figure out the trick. But, uh, unlike the rest of the game, this one isn't even satisfying to do once you have it figured out. Ah! Turn around, ninja! <laughs> Aha! Oh! So whatever you do, just try to avoid touching him. He does three damage, while the fireballs do one. Oh! As shown, I'm sure. Aha! Up! Oh. Where to? Oh! Come on! Calm down, focus, get the job done! At least the game's gracious enough to give you a health refill between each boss phase! Take that, Shakyo! Hey, it's the girl! She's safe. We're grateful for this for some reason. Come on, Dad, let's get out of here. <laughs> I've had enough of this. Wait, boy, before we do the demon statues, we've got to throw them from the temple. But we still have time for the black moon shines. Good question. Oh, I guess that would do it. You aren't one for taking action, are you? Right. Safe stake, cause uh, yeah. Once again, if we die to this thing, it's back to six one, and then we get to do all those boss fights again. Isn't that great? Start out by dealing with the head and the tail. The real threat are the are those fireballs. Oh, the head only does one damage. But now that those two are out of the way, we can stab the heart with. Hopefully with less getting caught on fire. Yeesh. I'm sure being sent back to 6-1 is just a, de is a developer oversight, but seriously. Ah! I got it. We win! It's over! It's finally over! Wake up, Dad! I did it! Let's go home! Son, I haven't got much longer. 
This temple's about to break apart. Take that woman and escape. What are you saying, Dad? I can't just leave you here. Son, you are a man now. My destiny is tied to the demon statue. Good luck, my boy. He's dead, Ryu. <laughs> well, hopefully Ryu managed to pull himself together and actually get some... and actually perform some kind of escape action. Yeah. It's breaking up! Hooray! He actually did it! And he lost his mask somewhere in the process. Ryo, you look amazingly Caucasian. Hmm? Ah yes, he does work for Foster. It wasn't so much of an explosion as, as it was an implosion, but I knew that thing could be seen from orbit. Wait, what? Job well done! Now kill the ninja! Um, I think that might be a little outside her ability, but... <laughs> so that was your plan. I'll get you for this. I got two kinds of payment. The first, I have received. The second, is you, Foster. I, she gets rid of, of the communication device so that she can actually talk to Ryu. <laughs> Wait, what's the payment? Oh, she's right in front of me. <laughs> Cute. I guess that explains why Ryu actually gave a rats about her well-being. He was in love. It was a love at first sight type of thing. Her name is Irene. Yay! Look, the sun is rising! Everything's so bright now! The darkness is over! Hooray! And now we get to have our credits. Hey! Uh, Ninja Gaiden is a challenge. A very, very painful challenge. I will say, except for the end bosses, it's it's rewarding when you actually figure it out and can and can perform. Until then, it's it's the sort of thing that makes you wonder how anybody could he could. Uh, Well, that happened. I don't even remember what I was saying now. It's, uh... I gotta say, it's like... Yeah, the game is rewarding once you can actually figure out how to do it, but until you are able to... Until you figure that out, it sure makes you wonder how anybody managed to finish... Managed to finish this game on console without destroying it. Oh, wait. I know how. Because it was an NES cartridge, it cost 60 bucks. <laughs> it was expensive. Oh well. I'll be getting to see other games in the Ninja Gaiden series, but uh, I won't make any promises on when that'll happen. Until that's. Uh, this has been Ninja Gaiden. I've played it. I am Rufal. I've played this game for you. Is this another game you'd like to see me play? Feel free to ask. 
until then, I will see you next game. Later. That doesn't even make sense, Tecmo.